It's autumn, and that means it's black lager season. Guinness makes a fantastic black lager, so does Sam Adams. I went to Benny's yesterday, and I asked them if they had any black lager. None had come in yet, except the beer consultant, if you will, um, pointed out that this company here, Deschutes, or Bell's Brewery, whatever they are, they made a, uh, a black beer, a black lager. It's called Schwarz beer in German. Okay, it's called dark lager here. And this was made um, in celebration of our 30th anniversary. We're honoring our brewing family tree. This full flavored dark lager with roasty, nutty, and chocolate notes was brewed with our former head brewer, Tim Gossick, now at Bell's. It has an IBU of 30 and an alcohol by volume of 6%. Um, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. I think um, Guinness makes a much better black lager. So does Sam Adams. This is the Schutz Brewery in Bend, Oregon. Family, owned, family and employee owned since 1988, which is really the best way to do it when it comes to um, small companies that make food like bakeries and whatnot. Um, yeah, so I had it with dinner tonight. It wasn't bad. Uh, I don't think it was fantastic. Uh, it was dark, very dark, so dark brown that it was almost black, and had a nice head to it. Um, I think, I really don't like beer that has an alcohol content of greater than 5%, because you get you get that communion wine taste at the end. But, um, yeah, this definitely, this definitely was in the black lager family. It's unfortunate that they won't be making this again, because this was a special brew, uh, specifically for their 30th anniversary. So FYI, if you can go and find it on the, uh, on the shelves, try it.